spray me with your little hairs. You just keep going on your way. It just came over and gave us some stuff from his garden. I love harvest oh, time. Oh, that is nice looking. Uh, I, know. I love yellow squash. Yum, that is so good. Don't, don't squish my little, Ooh, look at these tomatoes. Squish the tomatoes. There's just nothing better than a fresh tomato. No. You cannot get anything that tastes like like they used to in the stores anymore. Oh, do you want to start another rant? Let's talk about <laughs> tomatoes. I can't buy a damn tomato in a store that even tastes. It tastes like water. Yeah, they don't have any And not taste. even good water. No. These are good. I like being around people that do gardens and harvest Oh, time. I know. There's always more than they can I eat. I know. I do miss gardening, though. The Aja's got beautiful right. garden All over we there. Just go waterman and <laughs> reap the benefit. I know, right? It's harvest time right it now. It is harvest time. Dave's over here mowing his lawn. He does so much mowing in Pennsylvania. I don't think he got enough. I gotta get going here. I gotta get some herbs over at Aja's garden. Hey, Mumu. Yeah, you wanna show him some of your stuff? You can, yeah. So nice. She was out here planting bulbs this morning. For spring. Yeah. So if you haven't seen Aja's garden area, um, I'll just show you guys a little bit of this, or Aja will, but go over to Aja's channel because you'll see all the things she's done. I think my um, thing needs water. Yeah, the rhubarb needs some water. Yeah. Most definitely. Um, so, parsley here. Yeah, I picked some uh, the other day. You, you just give me like two sprigs of it. Okay. That would um, be fine. That's all I need. There's sage. Perfect. Do you need any sage or nope. oregano? Or? Nope, I used the oregano the other day. There's more sage, and then we have the um, the lemon balm here. This yeah. is a Mexican tarragon. Ooh, I have to find something to make Yeah, it's supposed that. to be like licorice, I think. It's a mild licorice. It oh, like... it smells really good. Yeah, I love that. And then this is... Dinosaur kale. What other fun things do you have? This is arugula. And you remember I told you that this had gone to seed, right. and I cut it back, and I um, was gardening, and I just set it back there, and then a whole patch of arugula. <laughs> yeah, you can make such a good arugula salad. That's what we should do, too, tonight. Yeah. Jimmy's already made a salad. Oh, yeah, so good. And then what's this here? Uh, broccoli? I'm letting it, yeah, this is broccoli. I'm letting okay. it go to seed, because I'm going to collect the seed. Okay, all right. Yeah, now I use okay, the mint. Okay, this started... Like this big. <laughs> I was like, oh, it shouldn't spread too much. In oh, the yeah. Mint spreads like crazy. Oh, I know, but I was thinking, well, it's because I amended this bed, too. It really hasn't gone past the bed, so that's good. Right, and yeah. you've got grapes over there. What kind of grapes are those? They're the red seedless. Love those. Some of the squash that we're going to do this um, squash bake tonight. Now, some people have already come and picked some up, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. So they're, yeah, um, there Jeff were a Jason. lot more grabbed one didn't you grab one yeah i grabbed one and then jimmy grabbed one and that's a that's not no that's, that's a, a that's a yellow squad those are so good yeah so she just has all kinds of fun things it's really beautiful out here your pumpkin has really gotten big this week my pumpkin's bigger than your pumpkin <laughs> yeah that's a nice pumpkin. Yeah. This was um, like a little uh, one it was about this size okay of uh different colored ones and then it grew to oh this. okay because I I've never seen it like that before. It's really yeah, pretty no, to do that. Yeah, we got it from the store, and it was uh, different colors. They yeah. do different colors. And their fence so cool. You know, and they collected all this wood. And I got the fig. Oh yeah, you have one fig on there. A little baby uh, one. I've already had. So there's two little this babies. Is, yeah, but this there's is one a, over there. Yeah, I it's a little no. bit bigger. And this one had three figs on it. Well, actually, it had five. I ate two, and then I pulled the other three. Oh, up. I can see you picked it off. <laughs> yeah, because I'm trying to give the plant um, yeah. time to get established. There's, yeah, you got. So it doesn't focus on the fruit. This is, like I said, a Chicago fig. So oh, they're, cold they're gonna be so good. The dark foliage. Yeah, those are those are pretty. You've just done so much around here. It'll fill in. Yeah. I love how you've left all like the natural grass too because you know people oh, buy that the, stuff. Yeah. Along the oh, your little gnome is oh, yeah, your I little gnome to, is out here. I need to take care of it. Yeah, because it's gonna to rain. Show. These are some of the fun things that she got for her birthday. If you haven't seen uh, her birthday party and her opening all her fun gifts, go over to her channel, Pandemonium. I'll leave a link in the description. I gotta get in and cook. For our little uh, cook-off of spaghetti squash. 
What you doing, Dave? I just got that mowing. Oh, yeah, I saw. I, they saw too. <laughs> I said. This is kind of like being like when we mow grass at home. That's what I said. I said Dave's so used to having so much uh, grass to mow in PA that he couldn't get enough. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go get my uh, stuff done over here. Oh, this wind is cold. That wind is really strong out there today. It's been like that for oh, a couple days now. I'd say what three days it's been real windy. Scotty's just uh, Scotty's over here. I can't show you, but he's watching. NASCAR. NASCAR. All right, I went out and picked some more herbs. So I got a little bit more parsley that will go into the dish. This I'll just uh, save for the top. And I just wanted a couple sprigs of basil. Aja wanted to get rid of some of it. She's got a lot over there. So I'm not going to do a lot of it. And I just want the little baby ones. And then I'll just put that into a glass and use it later. And then I got some uh, oregano. This smells so good. Mm, love that. Oh, I'll go ahead and get that off. We're going to do dinner at 4.30, so, and I think it's about 3 now. That'll give me a little bit of time to get my squash in there, get that cooked, and let it cool down a little bit so I can handle it. Go ahead. Since this is all going in together, I am going to just wrap that up in the basil, the oregano. Just make it a little easier to chop. And let me see. Oh yeah, that's good. That's that's all I want. So <laughs> I don't really know, like I said, what I'm doing here, but you can kind of smell. I don't know. I cook by smell and taste, so I can kind of tell that this is probably enough. Not too much, not overpowering. So I'm just going to mince my garlic up and then I'll work on the rest of my veggies. I need to get my squash in the oven real quick here too, so as soon as I'm done here, I will do that. Now if it was just me, I would leave this pretty chunky, uh, the garlic, but <laughs> not everybody's as fond of garlic as I am. I love it. And I'm going to go, I'm going to put my holes down this way because this is about where I'm going to uh, cut it. And it's already splitting, so. You just, oh, there it is. It's splitting already. And then I'm going to come around to this other side. <laughs> Be very careful when you do this. That's probably good enough. It just needs to, it needs to vent. All right. So I'm going to put it on a pan just because those holes, uh, juice will come out of that most likely. All right, about an hour. All right, I went ahead and got my mushrooms cut up. I'm going to dice up some onion. I'm not going to make them real small, but I don't want them real big either. I think I want a whole onion in there. I think I'll just do a little bit more and that will be fine. Turn this on, get a pan on there. Start with my onion. I'll let that go for about a minute. So once that heats up and I can start seeing it cooking a little bit, I'll, uh, I'll add my mushrooms after about a minute of it cooking. So in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and get my shrimp peeled and uh, chopped up. Now I've never had shrimp with spaghetti squash. <laughs> so we'll see how it turns out. And I've never had Alfredo either with it. So we'll, we'll see how that works. Mushrooms in there now. Those will release a little bit of liquids. If it doesn't, then I just end up putting uh, a little bit of water in there to help Help them do their thing. But this is an excellent pan for 
uh, sauteing with no oils. Let's see, so I got two spaghetti squash, and I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten shrimp. And I'm just gonna cut them in, I don't know, little chunks like that. So I decided to uh, add a little sherry to this. <laughs> I, uh, I didn't want to add water, but it, they were sticking just a little bit. I just added some sherry to it with a little extra flavor. I'm not sure I'm going to be done with my uh, <laughs> my concoction here. But we'll see. It's my, uh, I'm going to turn my uh, oven up a little bit, get those cooking a little bit more. Once I take the spaghetti squash out of the oven, then I have to let it sit. And then I need to cut it open, and then I need to stuff it. So I need to clean it out and then stuff it. So I'm not sure I'm going to have uh, enough time here to do all that. But that's the way it goes. Uh, I'm going to put a little bit more sherry in there. Get my garlic in there. Just a little bit of toasted sesame oil. That's usually all I use. Um, just because I am going to throw my shrimp in here real quick. Put that over to the side. I got a little bay on those. There we go. Just give them a little flavor. Now the um, mix here is going to go back in the oven and I still need to put my Alfredo sauce in here so I'm not real worried about those uh, shrimp not getting cooked all the way up. I think I'll put some more paprika or put some paprika in there. Here's my herbs and then just my jar of Alfredo. So I always add stuff to my canned um, sauces. I just use this as a base, but I, I can't remember the last time I had this brand. So I'm not real sure if I even need to do that. Come on, get out there. I'm going to add just a little bit more garlic. I just don't feel like they were put enough in there. And a little bit more onion powder. No, I'm I haven't messaged, even started. I messaged that Terry is also running late. Very late. <laughs> Alright guys, so you just heard Dave. We're, some of us are running very late. Mine is still really hard. Now, I don't know if it's cooked inside or not, though. Oh, this is going to be the bear. Well, I think mine's actually cooked inside. Oh, that is... Okay, it's cooked inside, but it's... Yeah, those skins are still hard. Now. Yeah. Yeah, but... Uh, now, I'm going to... You're supposed to let it cool down so you can handle the darn thing. You know? Yeah. Uh, things are different because, one, we're in high altitude. Woo! Hot, hot, hot. You know? Yeah. That might, not, that might not work too well. <laughs> so it's 412 now. Yeah. 105 sound. Yeah. Is that what you're going to tell them? Yeah. What does 5 sound? Well, and Susan replied, late. I thought it started at 430, which is 20 minutes away. I'm going to say, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to reply Five sounds better over here. Well, like I said, I've never made this before. I've got some cheese over here. I didn't have any cheese, so my girlfriend, Colleen, brought over some uh, mozzarella sticks. <laughs> I know Dave has cheese. Um, I think I'll, I'll probably be okay, I, would, I think. But now, this is what some of the recipes said. Take this out, scoop it out. 
Well, even if you're fine now, if you know in the future you want to find yourself in another cheese crisis. Okay, I know where to go. I already knew that too. Uh, well, I, I want to get. I staff yesterday, so I stopped. I just got fresh stock. Okay. <laughs> I know you have. I know you have good cheese over there too. All right, so I want to leave some of the uh, spaghetti sauce or spaghetti squash in, so that the. <coughs> You serve it in here. You put it back in the oven and bake it. I think I am gonna dump it all in. I think I'll have plenty. Oh, 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 hot, hot, hot. This is why you're supposed to let them sit. These just came right out of the oven. And they, you know, they are. are good, just a nice big of butter, of butter. Oh, you know how my mom butter, used to make? Pepper? Yeah. Oh. My mom used to make a she used to put butter and brown sugar and bake them. Oh, so good. Getting up at four o'clock in the morning is not good for me. What the hell did you get up at four o'clock for? Um, coyotes. I don't know. That's so good. It's up. That's so not like you to get up at four. Well, uh, she wakes up and I don't. Really well, the last three, four nights I've been getting up at about three something. I know. Yesterday I, know. I was up at 3.15. I just couldn't go back to bed. Hello? Daddy, are you okay? Get in there, get in there, get in there. What? Am I okay? What? Yes. Um, okay, so this is really good. You're, you're slapping on your solar. Hey, 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 hey. I'm, I'm filming. I'm so powered up. Oh, you did that today? Yes. You have 10 miles on a bike? Yeah. All right, we've kind of got a full house going on here, so everybody's getting ready to go over there. And I still got to throw mine in. I'm gonna turn my oven up just a few. A different things. Now I'm feeling kind of rushed. Thank you for the cheese, Colleen. Dave's got some too, so I don't need any. I know, but I don't have time because um, they just said, I mean, it's almost 4.30 now and I gotta put these back in the oven. So this just seems like the easiest way to do this. That Aja will be late too. <laughs> she usually is. She usually is. Yeah. Monday, the winds are only going to be six with gusts of ten. That might be the day you want to get on the roof. Oh, I don't have to go up on the roof. Oh. That's all done. Oh. Okay. I got really rushed. I, I'm a little late. But Jimmy just came over, so it's it's okay. Let me show you. I don't have a I have a broiler um, at the bottom of my oven. It's not the best broiler in these little uh, RV ovens, but my squash is too thick to be able to put it under there. So that's what it looks like. It looks like little marshmallows on there, and that's just because I used uh, the shredded cheese sticks. I have no idea what's in here or there or there, but here's some roasted squash. They all have uh, tinfoil over them. <laughs> Here, look. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, but see, my, I can't put those under my broiler. This is sausages. Oh, sausages. And that's pesto. Pesto on squash. Ooh, baby. Smells good. Oh my god. What's that? That's like meat sauce. Meat sauce. Here. Oh, meat sauce for this. Yeah. Oh. I don't know who this one is. That's Alfredo. Oh, oh, I did Alfredo too. <laughs> <laughs> and then this must be Sears. Oh, yum. I love that. That's for my that's summer, that's, squash. That's summer squash. I love that. This is from the garden, but yeah. summer squash. Yay. Well, that's oh, this is fun. I think we'll probably have a fire tonight. She was fighting mm -hmm. oh, no. This is a lot of food, but it's all spaghetti yeah, squash. Spaghetti. <laughs> yummy, yummy <laughs> food. Besides the... Oh, no! There goes my fork. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. So super like good. I know, right? Like, you can have a whole lot of that uh, and not I'm feel gonna... guilty about it, except for some of the <laughs> toppings. Yum. Can you buy me a skidover? Oh, you got it? Yep, I got it. It's our first squash festival. That's right. I love it. <laughs> yeah, Woohoo, the squash festival. I love it. Okay, so, have have that. so yep. next year we'll really ha we'll yep. have to dress up as squash and then make squash. <laughs>
<laughs> it won't have to be a big deal. I'm gonna be a. Um, I'm I gonna, think it's great. A great thought. A green a zucchini. I'm gonna be a zucchini. <laughs> Everybody should dress up as some kind of vegetable. <laughs>